Welcome to the autonomous period as usual. 17 41, quickly delivering a cone to the cube to the top part of their grid area. Transitioning outside their taped area for movement points and then back potentially for level 18, configuration. 4096 also attempting to get in that level configuration alliances. as we end autonomous uh, period. Both teams looking pretty good at the moment. Equal scoring on both sides. A couple more game pieces for blue, but that can be made up in the course of the two minute remaining game. 50-10, Tiger Dynasty, that's the team from Fishers quickly delivering a cube to the center part of their grid, and they're already halfway across the field to go get another one, minimizing that cycle time and trying to get as many points as possible for their alliance. 4926, that's Galactic out of Columbus, has that mechanum drive wheel mechanism that allows them to translate left, right, forward, backwards, and potentially do some nice things that you could get out of a higher expensive mechanism. 461, that's Westside Boiler Invasion quickly placing a cone onto the top part of their grid. Their teammates also matching them. That's two links, folks, in just a short time. Blue Alliance skyrocketing leading their score with three links or maybe two. They are in, are in cooperation, so the Red Alliance just needs to match them in order for that threshold for the ranking point to be lowered for both alliances. 99-99, swiftly placing a cube into the bottom part of their grid for two points for their alliance. 461, not to be outdone, quickly meeting with their human player through the human player station to get a cone into their mechanism, quickly zipping away and ready for placement with just under a minute remaining in the match. 4926, that's the Galactech, has that unique swinging arm mechanism that allows them to potentially pause it on either side of their robot. They aren't moving too much, so we'll check in here with 5010, just passing in front of the game announcer, placing the cone into the bottom part of the cube. With 30 seconds remaining, and the Blue Alliance is nearly filled up all of the places available. We might be looking at a potential new high score, but we'll have to see what happens in the end game. There are only 20 seconds to make these critical decisions. Two Red Alliance, Red Alliance robots already on top of their charge station. Blue Alliance potentially looking to match them here shortly. 5010 and 461, both Indiana teams. Potentially Control Z sliding in with a few seconds remaining. We'll have to see how things are going. They're trying to get things level. Time's running out. But that was the end of qualification match 26. We'll have to see how these scores total up. Here are your scores. Winners are the Blue Alliance with a high score of 156, taking all four of those ranking points that they need to increase their ranking point average. Now only one qualification match before we head into our next event. All Blue Alliance holding or moving up in those rankings.